Hey guys, Bernardo here with Tactical Fitness. We're gonna talk about how to adjust the grip on a Glock pistol. First things first, make sure your weapon is safe. Remove the feed, lock your slide to the rear, inspect the chamber. If you are clear, I want you guys to go ahead and remove the slide. This is just gonna make it easier for us to uh, change the grips. And let's talk a little bit about why should we adjust the grip, right? In this case, as you can see, my hand's pretty big in relation to the gun, and the optimal point for my finger to be sitting on the trigger is the center of the first pad. So if you feel like your finger is too big, it's not sitting in the right place or too small, you might have to adjust the size of the grips to kind of like um, balance with the size of your hand, of the palm of your hand. So once I've determined which grip I'm going to need, I need to remove, okay? Using this punch, I'm going to remove the original pin that's sitting on the gun. And I really, all I have to do is push it down and I am keeping it inside of this tape roll to make sure I don't lose it. I'm now going to uh, grab the grip that I want. In this case, I'm gonna grab the biggest one. And to install it, I like to start from the bottom and then click it in, okay? To place all the way up once you hear that click and you can see it's almost sitting perfectly all i have to do now is place the second pin now some of you might not know this but there your glock is co comes with two pins as you can see the original one is smaller than the secondary one and you're going to need the secondary one uh, to make sure that it's uh, gripping okay the additional back strap that you put on the gun so once I grab my new pin, then I'm going to go ahead and uh, push it in. Use your tool. And then uh, push it in, hammer it in a little bit until it sits well, okay, on both sides. So that you don't have one side that's sticking out, maybe um, coming into contact with your hand. Once your grip uh, is adjusted, then just go ahead and reassemble your pistol and perform functions checks. All right, that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please check us out on tacticalfitnessaustin.com and see you again on the next one.